Next, we're going to be learning about Google Docs. To create a Google Doc, you will need to log into your RCSD one-to-one -one Google Drive. Once in your Google Drive, click on the word New on the left side of your screen, and then select Google Docs. When you have your new Google Doc open, you should always give your document a title. You can click in the box in the upper left corner where it says Untitled Document and start typing your document title. This way it's easy to locate documents saved in your drive. Notice that a Google Doc is very similar looking to a Word document. So the toolbar looks like a Word Doc. You will see the word File. This is what you can click on to print your document. You can also make a copy of your document here, move it to the trash or a specific folder that you would like your document located in. You can also print by clicking on the printer icon. You can click Undo and Redo. You will see font style, font size. You can bold print, italics, underline your text, change the color of your text. Here is a special feature in um, Google Docs that you can insert a hyperlink into your document. You can also align your text in your toolbar. You can also insert a picture by clicking on the word insert and clicking image. So today your task is to create a Google Doc with a title, text, and one relevant image. So for this document I'm creating a, a ticket out the door. The document you are working with today should be relevant to your curriculum. Think about a successful lesson you taught in your classroom or an upcoming lesson and create a document your students will use. Once your text is typed today, you're going to click on the word insert, click image. This will take you to your image search. You can upload an image for your document from, by clicking on the upload and get an image off of your computer. You can take a snapshot search by URL, get an image from an album on your computer, search your Google Drive, or just do a Google image search. That's what we're going to do today. In the search bar, I'm going to type the theme that I'm looking for. Once I search, you will see you will get numerous images from the internet that you could use in your document. Select your favorite image, click on it, you'll know you're, you've selected it because there'll be a blue check mark and it will be highlighted in blue and then click the word select. The image will appear in your document and you can resize it by drawing the corners in or out. So for this task you will be attaching your Google Doc in eLearning. For us to view it you need to make sure that you change the share settings. In the upper right corner, click on the Share button. Then you want to click Advanced. Where it says Private, only you can access, click Change to the right. You want to select On, anyone with the link can view, and then click Save. Once you see that change has been made, click Done in the lower left corner and now your document will be able to be viewed while we're grading in e-learning.